When I first read the script, I texted and I said, I'm in, that's it. I'm, up. I'm only 22 pages in, but my hands are trembling. If you want the marshmallow and son. I want to know who you're calling. Will you answer my question, you son of a bitch? Huh? Yeah, Delmo. I never heard of that name, you bastard! How does that sound to you? What? It's pretty messed up. It's got a twisted sense of humor. Um, but I love Longmont Potion Castle. By continuing to listen, you are acknowledging that you are in acceptance. If you are not, please hang up. Hello? Bob, are you guys making a movie about me up there? That's what I heard. Making a movie about you. Is that true or false? Uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure who I'm talking to here. Oh, I'm down in Dirty Rufus. It'd be nice if I was voiced It'd be nice by, if I was James, voiced Earl, by Jones or James Earl Jones or something. Yeah. Yeah. Why don't you just call yourself Waylon Jennings? Or uh, Morgan Freeman could play my voice in a flashback type of scenario. Yeah, but you know, I, I picture you as more of a masculine man than Morgan Freeman. I too, Mark. I picture a scene in which I'm whooping you in the ass. Oh yeah. What do you think of that one? When's the shoot? Oh, I'm shooting right now. I too, Mark. Hello, Jason. I have some news about the VCR. Dad doesn't know how to program Starting in the mid to late 80s, a dude from Denver, Colorado picked up the phone, hit record on his parents' answering machine, and dialed the number. This unknowingly launched the career of touchtone folk hero Longmont Potion Castle. Okay, you ready? Hi, I'm director David Hall. When I'm not making music videos for my favorite heavy metal bands, you can usually find me here, in my garage, listening to Longmont Potion Castle. I've been a fan for a long time. Now, earlier in the year, Rolling Stone and Noisy published articles on Longmont, and I knew I had to act before somebody else did. See, I wanted to make a documentary about Longmont for a while. I think it could be an amazing thing. See you, Mark. A few days after David initially reached out to me via email, I called him up about what a Longmont Potion Castle movie would even look like. We agreed a conventional documentary was out of the question. Vivek Venkatesh, my filmmaking partner from Dystopia Productions, now on board, and executive producer Rain Wilson, we approached Longmont and we struck a deal on the phone. Since that time, I've written a script and come up with the concept that Longmont, Rain Wilson, Vivek, and I feel is a great way to tell the story. Our Longmont Potion Castle documentary will be both biographical and investigative. It's going to be the definitive film about Longmont Potion Castle. By interviewing his fans, exploring the history of prank phone calls themselves, the tape trading culture that Longmont Potion Castle grew out of, and getting the word from the proverbial man on the street, this film will explore Longmont's infamy and get to the bottom of who the man behind the phone really is. We're going to travel to Los Angeles and Denver and to Reno, the Clown Motel. We're going to get to the bottom of the rumors that surround Longmont's identity. And we'll meet the real Longmont Potion Castle to ask him the questions that Longmont fans have been asking themselves and each other for years. To all LPC fans worldwide and locally, please join us on this real special journey of the creation of... Where in the hell is the Lavender House? The story of Longmont Potion Castle. I've got just a skosh more of info for you, so ring tight there, big guy. We are hoping to raise $100,000 to cover the production of this movie. That money will primarily cover travel and boarding costs for the filmmakers and their crew. We're shooting this film in Denver and Los Angeles over a period of six weeks. $25,000? We've got some film equipment rental, 
$15,000. Salaries for our film crew for six weeks of shooting, $20,000. Technical and post-production costs, $20,000. Insurance costs, $10,000. Merchandise production and associated shipping costs, $10,000. And all the money we raise is going to ensure this film makes it onto the big screen. See you, Mark. Your contributions are essential to help us make this film. And we have a host of incremental perks lined up that will please you and drive you wild. Firstly, anyone contributing will be mentioned in the credits of the film. Contributions of $25 and above will get you a digital copy of the film. $45 will get you a DVD or Blu-ray of the film with special features, uncut interviews, behind-the-scenes featurettes, and archival materials. $55 and above will get you all of the above and also get you a mini LPC digital EP, five unreleased phone calls from my vault, and a digital download of the soundtrack to the film, which I am writing, by the way. $70 and up will get you all the above, plus a physical copy of the soundtrack and a thank you call from me. The first 300 contributions of $100 or more will get you all of the above, plus a limited edition t-shirt that I am designing especially for the film. The shirt will only be made available through this perk option. For every contribution of $150 and over, you get all of the above, including the t-shirt, and I will print call someone of your choice and send you the check. <laughs> $200 and over will get you all of the above, as well as a personally dedicated and signed Blu-ray or DVD of the film, and a walkthrough on Skype of my recording studio. For those diehard fans who contribute $350 or more, you'll get all of the above, and we will arrange to have you interviewed and include footage of the interview in the documentary, and you'll get a 15-minute call to chat with me. For anyone crazy enough to help us out with $1,000 or more, you'll get all of the above, plus VIP access to the premiere of the film. Sorry partners, you gotta pay your own way to the location of the premiere. We'll let you know where it is. We'll let you know where it is. On behalf of Longmont Potion Castle, and executive producer Rain Wilson, Vivek, and myself, I just want to say thanks for taking the time to watch our campaign video. Connect with us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. We really look forward to bringing the story of Longmont Potion Castle to your hearts and screens. Where do you live? In the Lavender House. Where in the hell is the Lavender House? I ain't fixing to go no horror.